The camera is still rolling, is it? Isn't it? It's pretty much rolling. My camera is making me paranoid, even though the battery light's uh -oh. flashing and all that. But no, what we are talking about isn't really what we want to talk about. We actually got majorly sidetracked there. Some of the That's stuff good. that we do want to talk about, or rather that Monster wants to talk about, is and there's a certain specific game that keeps getting compared to other games, so I'm going to let him do his little tangent here. Uh, well, like, maybe we can, pr we'll get back to talking about, about the, the other thing we were talking about, but one thing that really, really irks, that really gets on my nerves, is whenever, whenever, like, a certain, a, like a third person action adventure game comes out, like say Darksiders, Castlevania Lords of Shadow, or Dante's Inferno. These are all games that, are, that get compared to another game, in which is God of War. Every review I hear for Castlevania Lords of Shadow is that, oh, it's like God of War, oh, it's like God of War, oh, it's like God of War. Shut the fuck up, okay? <laughs> it is a God of War. I like the way you did that. <laughs> I'm sorry. When I play Castlevania Lords of Shadow, it doesn't remind me of God of War. You know what it reminds me of? Castlevania. When you play Dante's Inferno, what does it remind you of? It reminds me of Dante's Inferno. When I play Darksiders, what does it remind me of? It reminds me of Soul Reaver, which is an equally awesome game, which <clears throat> I think the developers of Darksiders were heavily influenced by. When you play Devil May Cry, what does it feel like? It feels like Devil May Cry. <laughs> Are you getting this, people? Devil May Cry is basically Resident Evil with a much, much, much faster pace. And cooler. Okay. Yeah, like, Devil May Cry was originally supposed to be Resident Evil 3, but then, and the storyline and the concept that was, much, was too different from a Resident Evil game, so they decided to make it into another franchise. It was a franchise about how a, a dude who could jump in the air really high, hack and slash... It was about a guy and named Dante. Who could... could just blow the crap out of them with guns and just slice them into tiny little bits in a huge... You know, I mean, what was Devil May Cry when it first came out? No, everybody was like, you know, well, what's this new game that Capcom came out? And it was such a beautiful game. You play Dante, a guy who is, ha is half human, half demon. You find out his father was this great demon general that rebelled against Lucifer, or in this case, their version of Satan was called Mundus. But yet, conveniently, Devil May Cry, I think, came out long before God of War. But oh no, never mind that, never mind. Devil God of War is, you know, the shit. Like... Wait a sec. <laughs> anyway, while well, he's taking care of whatever he's doing, that's uh, so all everybody cared about was, you know, God of War, God of War, God of War. I'm sorry, people, but God of War is not the end-all, be-all. Yes, it's bloody. Yes, it's violent. Yes, it's cool because you get to rip people in half. Yes, Kratos is a bad-ass mofo. I understand that. But not every game that comes that came after the first God of War game is a God of War clone. And everybody's comparing that new Thor God of Thunder game to God of War. And to quote somebody on the YouTube thread... Thor is not Kratos. He is the god of thunder. Thunder. Not war. Thunder. Yes, there are god of war elements put in put in Dante's Inferno. And, and yes, in Devil May Cry 4. All that stuff. But, Castlevania Lords of Shadows has, has nothing that reminds me of god of war. Even the, go I'll admit, the Ghost Rider game that they came out with to tie the Nicolas Cage movie did have yeah, a little bit of like I a weird... I apologize for that. I, I'm sorry. I, I had a friend who called me, and he, he just called me to wish me a Merry Christmas. Yeah, <laughs> yeah but like I was saying, um, yeah, like I was saying, 
Devil Devil May Cry came out about like four years before God of War did it. And you know what? You want to know something? God of War, as great of a game as it is, it's not the it's not the magnum opus of third person action adventure games. Okay. That's pretty much what I actually discussed. (laughs) While you were like talking to your friend, I was in there explaining to the good people that. Well, I'm I'm sorry, but you want to know another game that God of War sort of copied a little bit, it, and it's a game, and it's a game series that used to be kind of really famous, but has long been forgotten, but the Legacy of Cain series, okay, for those of you who are not familiar, Legacy of Cain, the video game series, where you played as a vampire named Cain, and, and the, it was like some of the earlier Legacy of Cain games, well, they were mostly just 2D games, but later it would evolve into a third-person action series, which was very reminiscent of Devil May Cry, except it was a lot slower paced and it was a, a lot less complex than Devil May Cry was. But that basically forms the basics of what God of War would be. Okay? So you just can't sit there and pretend like God of War is the absolute most original game. Of course there are going to be games that come out that are going be somewhat like it, but even when, when a game that looks even a little bit like God of War, you can't go around proclaiming that it's a God of War ripoff. Yes, Castlevania the Lords of Shadow, it's, some, it's, it's somewhat, it's a, maybe a tiny little bit reminiscent of God of War simply because the fact that the main character, Gabriel, uses a chain whip, but that is it. That is the only similarity the God of War. And I'll never forget. Ever. I'll never forget when you and I were talking, because it made me bring up that one dumbass in this one form that I saw. And I know you and I were talking about it, and I was in tears just watching your face turn red about about the about the guy who said he basically said, "Oh, Castlevania rips off God of War," and he was talking about the. Original